What's going on everybody? It's your boy Jinxie and we're gonna go over APA format today. All right, because a lot of people was telling me they was having problems with it, so I was like, ah, I'm gonna do a video on APA format. So first thing we wanna do is open up Microsoft Word because every teacher want that DOCX file format to grade you on. So first thing we do, open up Microsoft Word and next we're gonna turn the, go on to the ribbon, go to home and change the font to Times New Roman and change the font size to 12, all right? Um, after that, we're gonna push page layout on the ribbon, push margins, and we're gonna push normal one inch margins on all sides. And then we're going to click our paper, center align it, push the space bar, I mean, not the space bar, the enter button eight times and that should put you somewhere in the middle of the page eight or nine times whatever i push it eight times you're gonna write the title of your paper space it's not space bar enter bar enter key can't talk right now your name enter key your instructor's name enter key the school you're going to all right now that you got that you're going to push the uh the enter key push then go to uh on back on the ribbon bar in, uh, insert page break and that's going to put you on your next page you should be, still be center aligned you're going to copy and paste your title of your paper right there and that's going to be where you well you're going to push enter and then left align and that's where you're going to start your right you're writing your paper at um, but once you push enter off of your title on the second page push uh, insert page break again center aligned put references this is where you're going to put your references at okay so now we should be going into the headers um, so uh, we're going to go to the ribbon and we're going to put insert header uh, blank regular first thing we're going to push is a uh, different first page okay and then we're going to go into our header and if the little box that says type text doesn't disappear after you push different first page, just go in there and push backspace a couple times, should be blank. You're gonna push, while you're still, do not go out of the header, you're still in the header, push insert table. And you're going to select a two by one table, which means that there are two uh, columns, no, only one row, all right? And you're gonna put uh, all caps, running head, colon, all caps, the title of your paper. Uh, so I'm just gonna put something and on the other side of this uh, table you're going to put uh, insert not insert I'm sorry you're gonna go to the header and footer tools back to the header and footer tools um, that you were just set if you don't know what that looks like you look up on your ribbon you're gonna see table tools which should be yellow or some type of color however you got your thing set up and header and footer tools and you're gonna push page number current position plain number and you're going to then push home and right align it now the what happens to me a lot of times when i'm doing this is that even though my paper is in times new roman and in 12 point font my header and footer will for some reason go to calibri i guess that's like the default um you know font and font or whatever so make sure that you look at this and see if your your text has gone to Calibri or some other thing in header and footer and make sure you just change everything to Times New Roman font and Times New Ro Roman uh, 12 as the size 12 point font okay so um, after you have this so you should have your number right aligned and your running head all caps colon all caps title of your paper inside the header uh select the entire thing the entire table so the table the number and your running head title um and go into table tools and all the way to the right you should see uh shading and border you're going to click border and select no border on when the drop down list comes down and that will get rid of the the table so it just looks nice and clean no lines okay 
So the next page, you're going to do the exact same thing you did for the first page, except um, you're not going to put running head or a colon and your uh, the title will be uppercase, first letter, regular letters, you know, lowercase, the regular letters, like, you know, regular writing. So my name is Joshua Jenkins, uppercase Josh, uh, uppercase J, lowercase Oshawa, uppercase J, lowercase Inkins, right? So that's how we're going to write it on the, on the second header. And then uh, at this point, the second, the number two should already be there. But if it's not, go ahead and push um, header and footer tools, page number, current position, then put two, right, go home, right align it, select the entire thing, go to table tools, and select borders, no borders. And then it should continue throughout your paper as many pages as you have. And that, my friends, is the format of APA. One last thing. Remember we went to references? We put the references, okay, on that page. When you put your bibliography or references or whatever you want to call it, you have a hanging indent, which means that the first line is the first line of the of the uh, citation is left aligned, and every line after that that's included in that citation is indented a half an inch. And you can do this by going to uh, home and going to the paragraph tab under home and going to that special little button we talked about. Um, special little button on the lower right hand side of the paragraph tab and selecting uh, sp uh, hanging intent under indentation under, and then it says special that bar you go to hanging now for some reason for the life of me I can't remember if I went over uh, the paragraph tab because I had to do this over because my daughter came in here and started messing with the camera and all that so it was uh, a bogus video so if I didn't then while you're setting up your paper you want to go to home on the ribbon and then under the, you will see font and then the next tab will be paragraph the right lower hand side there's this little uh, diagonal arrow thing in the bottom lower right hand corner of the paragraph tab you're gonna push it and uh, under spacing you will go it says before zero after 10 you're gonna change that 10 to zero on line spacing you will change line spacing to double it, it might say multiple or something you're gonna change it to double okay um, and that's part of the setup before you even get to writing your, you know, your title and all of that. Um, so if I didn't go over that first, I'm so sorry. Because um, I can't remember if I did or, or didn't. Because technically I did because I was going over it in the first video that I tried to record. But it didn't work out because of my daughter. So sorry, guys. But um, that is APA format. And I hope that I helped. If anything is too confusing... I might do another video or something or maybe record my screen while I'm doing it. That might help. So, again, guys, that's my time. It's your boy Jinxie, future nurse. I'm out.